I like this little cat gold digger. I don't know where the hell she, else she came from, but I'm starting to call her my Jewish American princess because she's so special. And she's like, give me some food, give me some treats. And uh, I put a little box for her underneath the kitchen table. <laughs> she loves that thing too. She's got another box underneath the kitchen table she can get on top of that's got like a soft um, rug on it, like a, a fluffy rug. So, <laughs> she's a freaking yo yo man. I was running spooky yesterday. There's Goldie. Hey, Goldie. Looking for some treats? He's looking for treats too, man. God. Mm. Yeah. There you go. There's some right there. This little girl. Here. Come here. <laughs> She's a hungry little fresh girl. I'll tell you that right now, man. She's kind of blowing up like a balloon, though. I'm get her some diet cat food. High fiber or something. Right? You always want food, and you go, brr, brr, give me some food, meow, meow. She pours, pours me. Yeah. She's a trip. Hmm. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's down here. Putin, what are you doing, huh? You starting to get along with these big people here? You getting along with her pretty good? She's Miss Special, huh? She's Miss Special. Yeah. You don't go too close to her because she gets mad at him. Yeah. God, she's eating that shit up. You're a treat freaking monster, huh? I don't want to give you too many of these because you don't run around enough. Damn it. I'll tell you one thing. Good damn thing the internet's around. I was out there, uh, well, I know the starter motor on my El Camino is kind of like messed up, you know, it was, it was getting messed up. It's been in there since, I don't know, I had the car, it's been there since 91, and uh, uh, either that or battery's going too, but uh, I had a distributor out 180, and I said, oh, wait a minute, how could that be? I said, it sounded like it was out 180. I said, wait a minute. And I'm looking at, I look up on the internet and it says, shit, when you're lining the timing marks up on a gear set point to point, and you can't screw it up. I mean, if you do that, you know, you put them point to two marks right next to each other, the top gear, the top gear, and the bottom gear. You got a dowel pin, you got a woodruff key on a dowel pin on the crank, and you got a woodruff key on a dowel pin on the uh, camshaft and a woodruff pin on the uh, crank set. You can't mess it up. But that's, that's actually point, that's uh, number one exhaust stroke. I said, well, I thought that was compression stroke. So, and I says, you know, I noted that the distributor was, uh, rotor was pointing to the back of the engine. I said, well, the back of the firewall there, or back of the engine, whatever you want to call it. I says, normally it should be pointed to the front. Well, it, it was pointed to the front because it actually, I was 180 off. I says, well, shit. So, get everything done right on that damn thing. Just that I got to do some more shit and, I can't. I I don't have time to only work on a car. That's a problem. And uh, it's not that these gats take up all my time, but um, they take up some time. But I've been calling her my Jewish American princess, man. Now she's like a special cat. <laughs> you are special, aren't you? And you know, I don't think there's too many white cats out there in the wild because you get a lousy camouflage. You know, if a cat's gray, um, they're going to blend in. Cat's brown or black or even even like that uh, honey colored like Goldie is, they're going to blend in with the foliage. But this one sticks out like nothing. I mean, she's like, mm -hmm. so I think they're breeded like this. <laughs> There's not too many white cats out there in the wild, that's for sure. Man, she's she's a she's a human cat. She don't like freaking cats. She likes me. Right? That's probably what it was, man. That's probably what it was, man. She went she went to me because she knew I was the guy, right? She get her a little get her a little collar or some shit with a 
store David I was like here you go see that you're my Jewish American princess aren't you huh aren't you right so what I wear all the time <laughs> see that what's that huh huh you blessed by the rabbi hmm <laughs> You're fucking funny, man. Yeah. She's like a human, though. This cat really is... She is just like a freaking human. And if I don't bring her in the bedroom, I'll hear her claw coming up here, climbing up on the bed. Well, there she is. Well, as soon as I go to sleep or something. She's right there. Right here on this thing. So, she's always hanging out with me. Little gold digger, huh? And that's not a bad term, man. <laughs> I just figured you freaking stepped in doo doo when you came here. You just knew this was the place to hang out, huh? Right? You happy little girl, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Look at that face. Yeah, we love you too, man. Huh? Yeah, hi. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. She's come a long way, that's for sure. <laughs>